You know, I won't lie to you right now and try to make you feel okay. Where I am currently at is Africa. And in Africa, when they don't like you, when they are jealous, when they are angry, what they do, they do bewitch. Even if they don't directly bewitch, they go to witch doctors and perform things against you as an individual so that your things don't go well, so things fall apart and all those things. Let me listen to here very well. It is happening. Whether you believe uh, that witchcraft can work against you or not, that does not mean they don't. And they do. I'm telling you something that is real. You know, you get what I'm saying? They do go there and attempt to perform, to do things, to ask those the witch doctors to block your things and all. And this is the thing here. Yeah. There is this other lady that I know around that is mad in the head. And I remember being told that it could have been due to that she had stolen somebody's husband and they performed things. That's why I say these things are real. We might just choose to not believe them, but people are still going. They do go like really. And those witch doctors, they do think that, yeah, this one will not prosper. And one thing that I also want to uh, show you right now is it's not a matter of... um you not believing it like i already said but people are being naughty that is why i was watching this other program on tv there's this lady this grand this woman old lady her daughter was killed by her boyfriend or so stabbed to death and this is a reality show remember they just narrate the story i like speaking about it so she took the knife out of the knife that that was used to stab that her daughter or a granddaughter and she said she took that knife and she took it to a witch doctor. And that man who stepped there, he never had peace, started seeing things. He even ended up asking for forgiveness, went to that lady's graves that he had killed. But things never went well up until he, he killed himself by, was it an accident or what? I don't know, but he, his world started to fall apart, started to be weird. But I remember mentioning it to my mom, I was like, that is the knife. There are some of those old women, they know that if you do this, it happens. And people, it happens like really. Listen, when people act naughty on you, there is a protection of the Lord. That is why when Balaam tried to curse the Israelites, it did not work because there was a protection. Let me tell you right now, there are some people who go crazy because they tried to be naughty and it reversed. The Lord protected you. Sam, listen. The people pay in different ways. Someone might not pay in this manner. Someone might get away with it, but find that they pay in another form. Someone might do the same sin and they don't pay for it. But let me tell you something. Never compare yourself. And when you see people being weird, if you knew the background of the story, you understand what happened, how they got themselves into that trouble. And right now, in the mighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ, I want to tell anybody that is going against you, everyone who does not want to stop up until they see you down, that all their wicked plans are falling down woefully. I decree and I declare protection over your life. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray. Amen. And of course, this was the gospel with, or should I say, this was Ishmael. And see you next time.